today we are going to talk about cell membrane in our previous lessons we have already studied about the structure of plant and animal cell and we know that outer covering of animal cell is made up of cell membrane while the second layer in the plant cell is known as cell membrane so if we talk about the function cell membrane is actually a very thin and elastic covering that covers the cytoplasm of the cell so all the eukaryotes and prokaryote cells they contain cell membrane the thin and elastic covering actually enclose all the material which is present inside the cytoplasm as we know this part is cytoplasm and in this case this is cytoplasm what is the other function of cell membrane cell membrane is a semi permeable membrane or semi permeable barrier which uh, allows some molecules to enter the cell and some molecules they do not enter the cell semi means half like for example if we have 100% molecules 50% they can go inside but 50% they cannot go inside so this is semi permeable membrane along with semi permeable it is also a selective membrane selective membranes mean that it selects the molecules and then let them go inside the cell for example, if there are some molecules not required by the cells or they are dangerous for the cell, they cannot go inside. So, it is thin and elastic covering, it is semi permeable and it is also a selective membrane. In this way, it maintains cell composition the other function of cell membrane is that it sends messages and it also identify other cells so what does it mean sense messages for example in the nerve tissues when one uh, somebody touches you for example the cell membrane it senses this message and send this message to other cells this specific function is actually happening in nervous or nerve cells And what about identify cells for example if some kind of bacteria enters inside the cell the cell membrane will identify the bacteria and it may kill or it may generate some cells that can kill the bacteria so this is the function of cell membrane the structure of cell membrane um, cell membrane is made up of lipid bilayer it is made up of protein and it is also made up of small amount of carbohydrates lipid bilayer by bi means two 
it means that cell membrane is actually made up of two layers of lipid here in this model you can see that this is one layer of lipid this is another layer of lipid so this is by layer lipid by layer it is actually a sandwich one slice on another slice making a by layer so the other thing is that it contains proteins the proteins are actually embedded in the lipid by layer here is protein these are lipid by layer the function of protein is that it allows some molecules to go inside and it also allows some molecules to exit the cell there are small amount of carbohydrates present in the cell membrane uh, which may be attached to proteins or they may be attached to lipid in this case here this blue part which is attached to the lipid it is known as glycolipid this glyco word means carbohydrates while here this pink part is actually protein and when the carbohydrates they are attached with the protein they form glycoprotein again the glyco part is actually for the carbohydrates there are some cholesterol present in the cell membrane when the biologist or scientist they discovered all these things they find out or give a um, particular model for the cell membrane which is known as fluid mosaic model according to this model that cell membrane is a lipid bilayer contains embodied proteins which uh, the lipid bilayer gives it the elast uh, elasticity and fluidity while the proteins allows some molecules to go in and allow some molecules to go out of the cells okay when you talk about cell membrane two terminologies are actually used one is cell membrane and the other one is plasma membrane so what is the difference between these two terminologies actually the cell membrane this term is used for all the membranes of the cell we know that there are so many cell organelles present inside the cell for example if we say there are vacuoles present which have membrane there are mitochondria present which have membrane there are lysosomes present or the golgi apparatus or all these things so when we talk about cell membrane we are referring to all the membranes which are present inside the cell or surrounding the cell organelles but when we talk about plasma membranes specifically we are actually talking about the outer membrane of cell so here this is plasma membrane so this is all about cell membrane its function and its structure if you have any more question relating to this topic you can ask me in the comment section and uh, if you need more material related to cell or eukaryotes procures or any other material you can visit the link in the description below thank you very much